So the internal mechanism I redesigned to move the wrist about might need to change it a little bit or might to make this piece bigger because it's bumping in ways I didn't see it in Fusion. But anyway, it uh, the servo can handle the weight just fine. And it's not running into that bottom port wattage. Not a big, it's not staying at a high level. It's only high when it's in movement, which it, I'm not going to be doing rapid movements with this part, but it can handle it now. And it's only at 5 volts, so if I need to, for some reason, increase the power, I can to 6.8, which is what these servos run at, So, which will then affect the wattage, but hey, it shouldn't be that big of a deal. As long as the wattage is not like at 3 or something constantly, you don't have to worry about it burning out, unlike these servos. So, hopefully, tomorrow I can redo that part, and then I can reassemble him, because uh, I've been trying to get his parts working. And I, and I just got on Glamrock Cheek because I didn't want to work on this anymore. But anyway, hello, 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 hello. And it's not that wiggly, but I can tighten some things up. Also, it's not really, it's disconnected in here, so I'm not sure how tight that really is.